break down some of the guys that he's bringing in. Why not start off with a kid from the state of Florida who Florida State made an offer for, Jerry. His name is Owen Carney, and he chose to go to Illinois. Yeah, no doubt. He'll be a uh, player that'll get in, be impacted right away with their defense. He fits in the Levy scheme. Levy runs the, the over defense. Uh, you have a defensive lineman here that can rush the passer. Here's another example of it. Closes the gap. Very well done. Uh, great growth potential. He's 6'4", 232. He'll be 250, 260 uh, before you know it. May, I think he's going to stay outside. He could move inside depending on how big he gets, but he's certainly going to grow, but he's got the ability to move. He's got good quick twitch. He does a good job disengaging on blockers and getting to the ball here. You see him closing down on the option. Really well done by him. One of the guys they got in on late was a cornerback, Nate Hobbs, who was committed to Western Kentucky. He flips over to them, and after seeing his senior film, I kind of wondered what was wrong, why he didn't have more offers. He's six-foot corner with long arms, great ball skills. You watch what he did as a return man as well, and you could see the athleticism. When he gets his hands on the football, he's liable to score, you see here, uh, on an interception return. He's a kid who I think can play out on an island. He's a kid who fits the mold all these schools are looking for in a cornerback because of his size and ability to challenge bigger receivers. He's the steal of the class, in my opinion. Dwayne Lawson, quarterback, junior college player, couldn't find a lot of action. I don't know how highly recruited he was, but he's a mature kid. He's a big kid, 6'6", 220. Uh, I thought his release was good, throwing the ball. Here's an example of an intermediate pass. We're going to see a run play here in, in a minute. So if they want to get into some, some quarterback run stuff, he can do that. He's certainly big enough. That's pretty impressive right there if Illinois would move a little bit more to the running quarterback. Alex Pachuski, uh, I, I got to tell you guys, uh, when you watch his feet, uh -huh. you find out just how talented he is. 6'6", 270, doesn't step in the bucket. His high school coaches did a tremendous job with his footwork because he is outstanding at it. He's going to continue to build that frame as far as putting on weight and becoming stronger at the point of attack. But when you watch his feet, you can't teach that kind of stuff. And he puts him in great position to be able to finish. And you see the nastiness kind of that he has. That kid, isn't he? I mean, that's what he's got to do. And I think oh, he's nice. got a tremendous upside when it comes to playing on the offensive line. For no Atlanta. bucket stepping for him. No bucket stepping. No way. Illinois, as we said, did a great job in the state of Illinois compared to what they've done in the past few years. Also remember, Love, he's got ties to the state of Florida. And he shows it there by bringing in eight guys from the furthermost state.